at last I'm back and we got out to uh, Arma Majavi. Oh, we're only running 4S today. I feel like 6S was necessary. Let's uh, come on to a, a little quick bash. <laughs> Just probably move that bench out of the way. Okay, so I guess these batteries are already dead somehow. I must not have ever charged them. So I got another set of batteries in here. Hopefully these ones are charged. That hurt. Let's see if the kettle would run off. That would have happened. Okay. That it came unplugged. Plug it back in. Go. Right, so we're still good after that crash. Looks like we're still running good. this thing today. Gonna have this truck a little while now. Um, I think it's officially time to kind of start bashing it, uh, giving it the Arma, Arma test, see if it lives up to what they actually say it's supposed to live up to. Um, let's go in for a full time. Look at that. Um, this truck is completely stock right now. Um, I don't have bat braces on here or nothing. Oh, 
everything from gearing to body to wheels to everything is just stock. As you guys see, I smacked that rip pretty good. Uh, when we get done, I'll, uh, I'll go over it and show you, see if I broke anything. Uh, right now, it's not looking like I did, but it doesn't really mean nothing. Slippery mud through there. I guess at least we're testing its fucking strength. Um, didn't mean to do that though. I haven't been meaning to do that. But... Oh well. Things happen. Well, I'm just reaching my hands in here. How dirty and mucky it is. And... So we're gonna try to not directly slam it into that road again. Um, see if we can make that happen. Um, I will tell you though, it's the first time I've had this thing on the mud or on the weather. It's kind of like this kind of wet, muggy day. It's about 45 degrees out here in Minnesota. Uh, driving great, handling great still. Even through the mud and the muck, uh, which. FCT truck you kind of expect it to. Um, it's kind of what they're based off. They usually race in is wet mud and dunes and all kinds of stuff. Um, I mean, as you can see by looking underneath, it's getting pretty muddy and crappy. Which I don't really like doing with my new trucks, but we'll make an exception to this one. Uh, let's hit that wood. That tree. Guys, uh, that's gonna be it for this video. I'm gonna go up. Uh, we're gonna take the shell off and look at it, see if I broke anything. Let's uh, see what's all going on with it.
All right, guys. So here we are after my something or my something. My Javi run away. Um, here's the truck. It's actually not looking too bad. Um, it's got some mud on it, of course, and and whatnot. Um. So, uh, what all have I broken this so far? I've actually broke nothing so far, and from what I'm seeing from today's run, I didn't break anything today. Um, besides this. Which actually, I don't know how that, it all just goes on with screws, so I can probably just replace that, no big deal. I'm gonna even just unscrew and then re-screw it back in. Um, it's flat here. But, otherwise, I haven't broken anything on this yet. Uh, not like my Creighton and my, uh, I got the steering real loose now, real loose and nice. Um, and when I first got this truck, I thought my steering was my steering servo was bad, but actually it wasn't. The where the pivot balls go in, they have an end that screw that goes in there that caps them to keep them from falling back and forth. <coughs> and those screws in there were actually way too tight, so that was my issue. Um, other than that, I haven't had any issues with this truck yet. Um, Steering servo, so that's why I ended up installing that steering servo, but I still have the stock one, the stock one is still fine. Take the battery back real quick. It's dirty, of course. So for those of you who watch my channel, you know I use gold bat batteries a lot. I've really been enjoying them, they've been working great. Um, so, I think that's all I've really got to say about this thing. Um, otherwise, I love it. It handles great. Uh, looks really realistic when it's going. Um, body's all dirty, of course, now, so I'm going to clean that out quick. Um, but yeah, otherwise, I've really been enjoying this truck, guys. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoy watching these videos as much as I enjoy making them. Ooh, look at that, actually. Take that back. Something did break. So, my body post did break on this right side. If you look at that. Cracked and cracked. So, back one's fine though. So I guess I did break something. I broke this front flap right there. And then I broke the body mount. Which I guess doesn't really surprise me honestly. Um, just cheap plastic. But yeah. So that's going to be it for this video guys. Uh, if you're watching this video and you're new, go back and watch some of my old Majavi videos. Um, go ahead and do that. Like and subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell uh, so you get my newest videos when they come out. Uh, that giveaway for one of these servos is still up, so make sure you go check that out. Thanks for watching, guys.